One of the co-stars of Cheech and Chong's Nice Dreams is Evelyn Guerrero. Evelyn, thank you for taking this time out. Thank you. Let me first ask you, how did your um, collaboration with the famous or infamous, should we say, Cheech and Chong come about? Um, almost by accident. <laughs> My uncle was working for them, and they were looking for a couple of girls to kind of match with them, with their characters. And they were getting all the wrong types. They were really looking for a girl that could do improvisational work and uh, would have a chemistry with them. And um, they, they wanted somebody that, that was an actress but was also real, in a sense, mm -hmm. um, and could do comedy. And I just uh, started talking to him. I met him through my uncle. And, and one thing led to another. And the chemistry just worked out fantastically. And I wound up being the only girl. <laughs> How much improvisation is there on the set of a Cheech and Chong film? Oh, practically 75% of the films are improv improvised. Now, when we say improvisation, are we, maybe we could define that a little more. Are we talking about rehearsed improvisation? Uh, I mean, you don't just... Oh, no. I mean, there's a storyline. Yeah. And um, he'll say, well, let's play it this way and see how it works. You know, we'll do it. And usually we'll get the take we want in three takes or so. I mean, mm. we work really fast together. And uh, so, I mean, it's not like we walk in totally in the dark, right. you know, and uh, go for it. Um, there has to be some rehearsal, but uh, it's so quick, you know. I mean, sometimes you, you have in mind you're going to do it one way, and all of a sudden they'll change it at the last moment. You, you know, you almost want to panic, but under pressure it just sometimes comes out great, you know, the mistakes and things. Someone has said that uh, you're almost the, uh, to Cheech and Chong what Margaret Dumont was to the Marx Brothers. How do you feel about that? I think it's a wonderful compliment. <laughs> She was marvelous. Uh, she was parts. marvelous, yes. Um, they're one of my favorites. Yeah. And um, people saying, you know, like I'm the new Lupe Vélez, you know, she was comedic. Yeah. And, um, I always considered myself a serious actress before this. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Um, I just think it's a wonderful challenge, and I love making people laugh. Mm -hmm. If I can continue to do that, then I'm going to do it. What about aspirations as far as um, you said you thought of yourself as a serious actress, but now everybody thinks you're so marvelously funny? What about the future as far as serious acting? Um, I've had a couple of really good offers for, for two films so far, and um, which I shouldn't mention right now, but they're serious roles, not at all like Donna. I mean, mm -hmm. which really baffles my mind because here I'm, I'm thinking, you know, I'm going to play these stereotype cheesecake girls forever, and it's not going to be that way. I, I'm seeing you know, that it's going to make a change. Yeah. And, um, but if I'll be happy just doing Cheech and Chung movies. <laughs> the rest of my life. Okay, for those who haven't seen Nice Dreams, how do you figure into this one? What's your character like here? Oh, she's, um, you know, it's Donna continued, you know, mm -hmm. going through changes and working your life out and, and making mistakes and getting back up. And, but she really has a lot of power, you know, over these guys. Um, I hope that that comes through yeah. in the film. I mean, they just follow her around, you know, like little puppy dogs. And um, she's got them under control. She's got animal under control. She's got, you know, all the men around, surrounded by, with her in control, you know. So I don't feel that I'm a prop. I don't mm -hmm. feel I'm used in the movie. I feel that I really have a power, a sense of power there. Well, I think the comparison with Margaret Dumont was, uh, was an accurate one. And certainly nobody could accuse Margaret Dumont of being just a prop because no. She, uh, no. she contributed so much to those films. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Do you... Um, do you have any favorites as far as uh, comedic actresses other than, I assume, Dumont? Um, comedic actresses? Everybody always mentions Carol Lombard and people like that. Oh, I've got to say Carol Burnett to me. Oh, yeah. Really makes me laugh. I mean, I just love that lady. Yeah. I think she's the best. <laughs> I agree. We're out of time. Thank you for taking this time out. Thank you so much for inviting me. It's a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.